is adored in Adelaide, and now he's wooing them in the West. Former Crows pin-up boy Tony Modra has lost none of his boyish charm since he joined his new club, the Fremantle Dockers. We caught up with him for this exclusive interview. I might have been pushed to an extent where I didn't think I did have much AFL football left in me from what they were telling me, so I obviously thought, definitely thought the other way and I had a, plenty, a lot more to offer, so that's why I thought, well, maybe it is time now to change clubs. Tony Modra's down. Tony Modra is down, Drew. So this is a tragedy now for Adelaide. They treated you pretty special over there, didn't they? They loved you. <laughs> I don't know about that. They just love their football, I think. And Tony Modra. <laughs> I don't know about that. Here they come. Modra getting mobbed. Trying to get away from it at certain times was a bit frustrating and hard, but um, I sort of got used to that, and coming over here is probably not much different. Modra! How do you compare it to Adelaide? Is it better, worse? Probably definitely a better coastline over here. Um, the, weather's, the weather's pretty much similar. People are a lot more outgoing over here. They enjoy their um, outdoor activities, obviously. But um, that's expected from what you've got here. It's been great. Well, I think a lot of the Fremantle people are really waiting for that day where Fremantle actually beat West Coast. So hopefully the first game of the season in 1999 will be the day. Wouldn't that be a great day? Your first game, <laughs> beat the Eagles. It'd be fantastic. We're looking forward to playing.